I'ma get this money by any means. I gotta get us dope on this triple. What's good with the two? It's me, Trucker AB, with another video for y'all. So, I'm in Georgia. Um, after I had that low, after I got that load from um from Kentucky to um to Orlando, I was in Florida for a couple of days. Well, I dropped it off to Sunday. And uh, I did my 34. So, ready to roll Tuesday. Tuesday morning. I went to Tampa, by the way. Check my people's whatever for my 34. That was cool. And then, Tuesday morning, dispatcher hit me up. I was like, yeah, I'm ready to go. Let's go. I'm in the truck, chilling, waiting. I didn't get the load at all. So, I know that Florida sometimes you can't get no load to get out of there. If not, they um they um the loads are dumb cheap. They wanted us to go to um Washington on some potato load for like fifteen hundred dollars. We're like, nah, you bugging? That's like almost a thousand miles. Crazy. Well, you kind of we kind of offered them for. 2500 out and we could have went in between if they, if they went down 23 i probably would have did just to get out of florida but it wouldn't have made sense anyway out of fuel and everything it's just a loss i'm poisoned right, sorry about that that was actually the um the the shipper office calling me letting me that uh, i could get my paperwork so let's get back to my apple um yeah, so I didn't get a load. I didn't get a load until she booked me a load on the Tuesday because she couldn't get it until we pick it up this morning, which is now Wednesday. But I missed a day. Sucks. Where is why? It is all right. Well, it is, I just had to take anything to get out of here. So couldn't get a load out of Florida. That's crazy. And I got lucky for all the times I've been going down there, I usually get a load out of there. Actually, good paying on soup. My last watermelon load, you remember I did the video, the paying was four grand, five grand, five and some change, I want to say. 52, I think it was. Well, it's a shorter distance, because this is going to Memphis. To the Kroger that I don't really like, where you got to go to the, um, the staging area. Horrible customer service there. Or shipper service, whatever you want to call it, where they teach. That's just really ghetto. Um, but I had to take it just to get out of there. She came this another day. At least I get a load done, get to deliver it in the morning. I pick up another load to deliver that by Friday. And now still have me a good paying, you know, week. You know, so it is all right. This is the hustle. It's part of trucking. It is what it is. Hey, hope it all is well. That's all I want to let y'all know that. It's part of the journey, man. I'm not stressing it. You know what I mean? I'm not stressing it. I'm not mad at all. I look at the positive of it. I was able to see my people. I was able to see my best friend. My newborn baby. I was able to chill there, do the 34. You know, I like Tampa a lot. But, um, I could probably chilled there another day with them on Tuesday, but they got a newborn baby. I think the newborn baby, you know, I got a loud voice. I'll probably make him sleep. I mean, he's cry more and all that. Like, who that voice, whatever. But, you know, I didn't want to overstay my stay either. I was going to see a hedgehog over there. I'm like, nah. Maybe get back, get back in the truck, you know? Well, it is what it is, man. So I'm loaded. Got a bunch of watermelons. Not that heavy either. I thought they were gonna fill up the whole trailer, so I think I'm at like 43. I had to slide, back, slide the tins back just a little bit. I'm gonna wear it. Let's see what's up. Well, until next video, y'all. Gotta stay safe out there. I'll holler at y'all.